Hey boys and girls, welcome back to another episode of Grandpa Story Hour. I am Jason, Wyatt, and Bailey's grandpa. Hello Jason, hello Wyatt, hello Bailey. Grandpa loves you a lot. Just want to say, I'm enjoying what we're doing right now. This will be the second of the six stories from this great book. Jason and Wyatt and Bailey love Bluey. So I thought, well, let's go get a Bluey book. And here we go. Bluey, the pool. And I think Jason and Wyatt and Bailey were just at the pool a couple of weeks ago, right? In Arizona? Hmm. Looked like it was fun. So here we go. Oh, yeah. Here we go. It's a hot summer's day. And Bluey wants to know what the family's going to do. Nothing until you've cleaned your teeth, says Mom. But Bluey doesn't want to. That's boring. Dad bursts in. Let's go for a swim in Uncle Stripe's pool, yells Dad. Yeah, cry the girls. Boring things are important too, says Mom. Bluey thinks that if boring things were important, then they'd be more fun. Uh-oh. Don't forget that swimsuit stuff, calls Mom. But Bluey, Bingo, and Dad are already rushing out the door and into the car. Mom is such a fuss pot. She always makes us do boring things, says Bluey. She does, says Dad. Uh-oh. When they get to Uncle Stripes, Bluey leaps down onto the footpath. It's hot. Bluey and Bingo don't have their sandals. Oh, ow, oh, oh, ow, oh, ow. Oh. Guess they should have packed their sandals, huh? Uh-huh. So, Dad ends up carrying them. Oh, I'm a giraffe. Then it's time for Bluey and Bingo to put up on to put on their rashies and sunscreen. But Dad's forgotten them. We'll just have to stay in the shady bit and we'll put uh, our our hats on, said Dad. What hats? asked Bluey. Uh oh. Bluey does the cannonball into the pool. This is gonna be fun. Bingo wants to jump in too. Dad, can I have my floaties? She asks. Sorry, Squirt, didn't bring them, says Dad. Bingo's not sure about the crawly thing either. Guess they should have mm -hmm, listened to Mum and pack better. Bluey wants to swim all the way to the other end of the pool, but she can't go into the sunny bit. You got no sunscreen on, reminds Dad. Dad, is the shady bit going to get bigger or smaller? Asks Bluey. Oh, bigger, for sure, says Dad. I, 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 meant, I meant smaller. The pool doesn't seem that much fun anymore because they should have listened to somebody dad i'm bored dad i'm cold dad i'm freezing dad i'm hungry dad i'm starving dad 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 mm. okay can everyone stop saying dad I think Dad is actually boring. Mom is way more fun, declares Bluey. A warm voice floats uh, into the pool area. Oh, that's nice to hear, says Mom. I brought all the swim stuff you left behind. Mom! Mom! Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hitting home, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Mom even remembered to bring morning tea. And Dad helps Bingo with her floaties after they've eaten. Mom helps Bluey put on the sunscreen. So, boring things are important sometimes then, huh? Says Mom. Yes, agrees Bluey. Goggles mean Bluey can play torpedo. Floaties mean Bingo can escape from the crawly thing. And sinkies take you to the very bottom on the pool. Now it's fun because they have everything they wanted. Okay. Where you can see all sorts of things. Boom. Next week it's Granny's. 
Jason, Wyatt, Bailey, I love you very much. Grandpa loves you. Boys and girls, I love you too. Thanks a lot for being here. Mom and dads, grandma, grandpa, Indian uncles, there's a Venmo account if you'd like to give us some help. We'd love you very much to do that. Till next week, Bluey, story three. Be nice to mom and dad.